Stuck with a drop shipping subscription you no longer need? Feeling the pinch of monthly fees eating into your potential profits? Are you tired of an Ollie dropship subscription that just isn't serving your business goals anymore? Or maybe you've decided to pivot to a different e-commerce strategy. You're not alone. Many entrepreneurs, at some point in their dropshipping journey, find themselves in this exact position. The landscape of online business is constantly shifting, and what might have been the perfect tool yesterday could be an unnecessary expense today. Think about it. When you first dove into the world of dropshipping, Ollie dropship probably seemed like a godsend. Its promise of automation, ease of product import, and integration with AliExpress was incredibly appealing. For many, it's the gateway to building their first online store. You bought the plugin, maybe even opted for a custom store. And for a while, it was exactly what you needed to get off the ground. But as your business evolves, your needs change. Perhaps you've outgrown the platform and are moving to a more advanced solution like Shopify with different apps. Maybe your niche has shifted and the products you're selling no longer align with Ali dropship strengths. Or let's be honest, sometimes the dropshipping dream doesn't quite pan out as expected, and you need to cut ties to minimize losses. Whatever your reason, canceling a subscription can often feel like navigating a maze blindfolded. Companies, understandably, don't always make it glaringly obvious how to leave their ecosystem. It's usually buried deep in terms of service, or requires a specific sequence of clicks that isn't immediately intuitive. The frustration is real. You're busy running a business or trying to, and the last thing you need is to spend hours figuring out how to stop a recurring charge. This isn't just about saving a few dollars. It's about reclaiming control over your business expenses and streamlining your operations. Every penny saved is a penny earned, especially in the tight margins of dropshipping. And an unused subscription is essentially a leaky faucet, slowly but surely draining your resources. So... How do you successfully cancel your Ali dropship subscription without pulling your hair out? That's precisely what we're going to break down today, step by step, making it as clear and straightforward as possible. No more guesswork, no more endless searching through forums. We'll cover the two primary scenarios for cancellation, depending on whether you're dealing with the Ali dropship plugin itself or a pro subscription, which often comes with a free turnkey store or services like Selvaya. Understanding the distinction is key as the cancellation process differs slightly for each. Let's start with the Ali Dropship plugin. This is typically a one-time purchase, meaning you bought the license outright. In this case, there isn't a subscription in the traditional sense that renews monthly or annually. You own the plugin. What you might be thinking of canceling or stopping are related services like hosting or specific add-ons that do have recurring fees. If you purchase the standalone Ali Dropship plugin for WordPress, remember, you paid a one-time fee for it. You effectively own it. Therefore, there's no cancellation in the sense of stopping a recurring payment for the plugin itself. However, if you're hosting your Ollie Dropship store on their recommended hosting, or if you signed up for additional services that come with recurring charges, this is where the cancellation process comes into play. For instance, if you're using their hosting service, you typically need to access your hosting account control panel. Look for sections related to services, subscriptions, or billing. Within these sections, you should find an option to manage or cancel your hosting plan. If you're unsure or if the option isn't immediately visible, your best bet is to contact Ali Dropship support directly via email at support at aladropship.com. Be clear in your request, state that you wish to cancel your hosting service and provide any relevant account details like your domain name or client ID. Now let's move to the second and more common scenario. Canceling an Ollie Dropship Pro subscription, especially if you opted for a free turnkey store or a Selvaya subscription. This is where recurring charges are involved. Ollie Dropship's terms of use state that for a Pro subscription, you have two primary ways to cancel. The first method is often the most direct if available, through your Pro subscription account. You need to log into your Ollie Dropship account. Once logged in, navigate to the Stores section. Within this section, you should see your active pro subscription. Look for a cancel link or button associated with your subscription. Click on this link and you'll likely be prompted to confirm your cancellation. It's crucial to follow all the on-screen prompts and ensure you receive a confirmation that your subscription has been successfully canceled. This often means you'll retain access until the end of your current billing period, but it won't auto renew. The second method, and the one that acts as a fallback, or indeed the primary method for some associated services like Selvaya, 
is to contact Ali Dropship support directly. Again, the email address for support is support at aladropship.com. When sending your cancellation request via email, be sure to include all necessary information to help them locate your account quickly. This includes your registered email address, the email you use to sign up for the Ali Dropship Pro subscription, your username, if applicable, while not always required, it can help. The domain name of your store. This is essential for them to identify which subscription you want to cancel. A clear statement. Explicitly state that you wish to cancel your Ali Dropship Pro subscription. For example, I am writing to request the cancellation of my Ali Dropship Pro subscription associated with the email address, your email, and the domain, your domain name. It's highly recommended to keep a record of your cancellation request, especially if you're doing it via email. Save the sent email. And if they reply, save their confirmation email as well. This provides you with proof of cancellation in case any further charges appear. Ollie Dropship's terms also state that a service is considered canceled only after you receive a cancellation confirmation from a customer support representative. So don't assume it's done until you get that official confirmation. A crucial point to remember, especially with pro subscriptions that offer free trials. If you cancel during the trial period, your pro subscription account is typically canceled immediately. However, if you cancel during a pay period, your subscription usually remains active until the end of that pay period and will not be renewed. They generally do not provide refunds for unused portions of a subscription if you cancel mid-period. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.